Hello everyone, it's Drip again. Today I'm gonna to be doing another new another react video again. And this time I'm gonna react to the NK of Pizza Salad. And this time I'm gonna react to his new to the new video that he has uploaded today. And the video I'm gonna to react to is called Burger King Quad BK Stagger 2023 Review. So yeah, I'm gonna to react to it. So before you even start, I wanna give a disclaimer. If you do not like the content I make, the reaction videos, or any of the other stuff I do on my channel. If you don't like them, then don't watch the goes around. Because the only thing you're doing is giving me a view. And that's the answer for one. That's the damn truth and nothing but the truth. So yeah. So now without further ado, let's get to the video. Right now, let's get it right now. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with the NK. Stay frosty. What's going on, everyone, and welcome to the channel, where today I'm over at good old BK to check out an ultra-rare quad burger siding that just happens to be part of their latest returning promo. That's right, everyone. It's not every day that you see a quad burger over here at BK as part of their regular menu offerings, and for this latest promo, it's definitely on Showcase, and I'm going to showcase it for you right now. Feast your eyes on what I've got here. It's the quad BK stacker, a very cheesy, very meaty situation here, and I got to say, this looks absolutely gorgeous. Let me break this one down for you real fast. Yes, sir. Lots of flame grilled beefy goodness to oh, go yeah. with all the ooey gooey cheesy goodness. That is definitely the way ENK likes to get down with it over oh, here at yeah. BK. This is looking pretty awesome. <laughs> so let's pop the sesame seed bun and take a look underneath. And right oh, away, yeah. tons of stacker sauce on the very top of this one, guys. It is all over the place. Oh, yeah. As we pan on down, it is definitely a gluttonous situation for sure. We've got plenty of their crispy bacon. And that's all on top of four flame grilled beef patties, guys. It's actually a half pound of beef before cooking. So this is definitely stacked for sure. A little on the small side for the patties, but guys, the thickness is definitely there. And then naturally separating each of those patties, if you can even see the separation, four slices of American cheese. This thing is all congealed together. And I got to say, the aroma is definitely kicking in the car here right now. This looks super satisfying. Oh, yeah. And truth be told, I don't even have to split these burgers individually because I can see they're stacked pretty high. This is oh, looking yeah. pretty great, guys. So let's not waste any more time on this. Let's get yeah. into it. It's the all-new Quad BK Stacker here at BK. Let's peep out this flavor. So yeah, man, four little patties over here for this little stacker. And it almost feels like a snack-sized burger, but naturally when it's stacked up with all this goodness. And trust me, you're going to see a lot of footage like this all throughout the review. This is definitely a very rare sighting over here at BK because they don't normally do quad burgers. I mean, here on the West Coast, We've got Jack in the Box, which loves to oh, do yeah. the quad burger situation for the beef as well as the chicken. I think over at Wendy's, pretty much a triple is the highest that you can go. So uh, even still, these are smaller patties, but at the same oh, time, yeah. very satisfying with the cheesy action and the bacon and the stacker sauce. Let's not waste any more time because I'm doing that right now. I want to get into oh, this. Yeah. This is the all-new Quad BK Stacker here at BK. Let's peep this out. Oh. <laughs> Beefy. <laughs> wow. Well, right off the break, don't let the size fool you guys, because even though this really feels like more of the value bun uh -huh. situation, the meat is absolutely stacked high. And as you can see, I've got a lot of flame grilled goodness to go in on with this, guys. Uh -huh. This is a really beautiful situation. It's classic BK flavor. You can definitely know it when you taste it. Plenty of cheese, the light zip and tang that I'm getting from that stacker sauce. The bacon itself is pretty banging as well. Let's keep going in, guys. This is crazy delicious, uh -huh. crazy gluttonous. I'm so glad I'm doing a quad right now. Let's keep going in. Mmm. Mmm. What beef? Well, if you're watching this review after hours, please accept my humble apologies because first thing in the morning, you need to get yourself over to BK and pick up one of these quad BK stackers. These are very satisfying. I would rock this for breakfast easily. As you can see, plenty of the beefy goodness. This really does feel like a half pound of beef for sure, guys, because like I said, even though it's stacked high and it's a smaller burger, the oh, yeah. fact that it is stacked high is very gluttonous when you bite into it. Very awesome. And just like I mentioned earlier, this is pretty much classic BK flavor, guys. And again, I got to keep showing it to you. Just like I remember as a kid, definitely the flame grill goodness, very familiar oh, with yeah. that stacker sauce, adding just a little bit of zip, a little bit of tang. It's not quite Thousand Island, but it's definitely unique. Oh, yeah. And that's the smokiness of that bacon on top of it, guys. Very tasty. And again, with a half pound of beef before cooking, it feels like it. So it's very dense, very thick, oh. small in the palm of your hand, but oh, very yeah. satisfying. So let's go for another couple on this one, guys. Yeah. Super delicious. You know oh, that yeah. by now, right? Mmm. Yeah. You know, it's funny. I was going over my BK playlist here on the channel, and I noticed that oh. I've never had a quad variation of any of the burgers over here at BK. Oh. I've done all the King Burgers throughout the years. Huh. So this essentially is pretty much like a King Burger because it's a half pound of beef, huh. two of the Whopper-sized patties. 
but it's split down into four. So it sounds like a lot, and hmm. it is because it's very dense, but it's oh, small yeah. enough to really feel like you're getting a lot of beef for the money with this one, guys. Considering the price point here in Southern oh, Cali, yeah. about six sixty nine, a little bit more of a premium, but the flavor is banging on it, and that's really where it counts. All right, so let's go for one more bite before we wrap the review with the rating coming up next. But guys, again, a very gluttonous situation. And again, I got to keep showing it to you because these patties are beautiful. They are just stacked pretty beautifully. There's plenty of cheese, lots to go in on with this one. And again, with more of a premium, this really feels like it's worth it because of the size. It's pretty huh. thick. One more bite, we'll wrap this one up. Hang on. Mm. Well, this little mini-me over here at BK really packs a punch, guys. I am oh, totally yeah. digging the amount of beef on this. And as we go around the world <laughs> with this one, lots of cheesy goodness. A very basic build with the meat, the cheese, the bacon, and the sauce. But I got to say, I am loving the combination. And like I said, even though the premium is up there in terms of price point, this is very satisfying, very hard oh, to yeah. bite into. An easy recommendation to give this version a shot. It's pretty nice. Yes, sir. Definitely a lot of fun checking this one out today, and I'm so glad to have done it, too, because mm. now I can pair this review up with the previous one that I did way back right. in the day, which I believe was the double BK stacker, and that was oh. a lovely situation even then. But naturally, with two more patties added to this one, oh, yeah. of course, guys, you do have choices. Should you want to do a little bit less than that naturally, as you're seeing here up on the screen, some different options are available. But I got to say, and I think most of you guys know me by now, if there's a quad option of something right. on the menu that I'm reviewing, I most definitely want to give that a go because naturally oh, yeah. I'm a fan of meat and cheese and this one is definitely oh, yeah. geared towards my type of people. So I am definitely down with that. And hey, if you've made it this far into the review, you're most likely a meat and cheese type of peep just like myself. So I think I'm in good company right now and I think you are as well. All right, guys. So overall for the rating, I'm going to have to give the quad BK stacker here at BK a rock solid 8.8 .8 out of 10. Oh. Very solid, definitely meaty, definitely cheesy. Very satisfying and price point notwithstanding, that's just a little bit more elevated. You're getting a very girthy type of burger to bite into. It's gluttonous. It's definitely got all the goodies in there. Plenty of meat, plenty of cheese, the stacker sauce, the bacon, and of course that sesame seed bun. Classic goodness, very basic, but super delicious. All right, so now outside of confirming if you're a meat and cheese type of peep, drop those comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this particular one. I mean, did this actually look like it was worth the six sixty nine for you here on the West Coast? Does it look like more bang for the buck for you considering the size of the meat? It may be small, but it's thick. But what did you guys personally think? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high-quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So I stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay Leave frosty. Hey, thanks for checking out this review. And I'm going to be the video right there. So yeah, and that's the reaction bell. And I hope you guys like this reaction bell. And I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it. If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the keys of all time. Every time I upload, and share my videos, reaction videos to your friends and family. Also, if you want to, it's your choice. Because I ain't making it. So yeah, and don't forget to subscribe to Ian K. Always channel, peep this out if you're new. Subscribe to his channel if you're not subscribed yet. Subscribe, subscribe, and road to two K subscribers. Hope we can hit it, and uh, see you all for more banger content to come and more banger reaction videos. So yeah, and I'll see you in the next time. Keep your shorts on, y'all, and peace out, shorter legends, and peace out, everyone.